from Coach Mika today. Now we're going to keep the same routine of our warm-up stretches, followed by a fitness challenge. Then we're going to finish our day with a hand-eye coordination activity and a cool down. So get ready to follow along with the music and copy the moves. Now make sure you're hydrated, your shoes are tied, and you have a clear and clean workout space. Coach Maker Fitness Games is brought to you in partnership with Character. It's the pattern of thoughts, actions, and feelings you show over time. Character is Honesty Courage Loyalty Responsibility Virtuous and integrity. Character. It's the pattern of thoughts, actions, and feelings you show over time. Now we return to our regularly scheduled programming. Now that we've had a word from our sponsors, let's get active. Whoa! Let's go ahead and stretch first. The first stretch is a hamstring stretch. Slowly walk your fingertips down your legs until you're touching your toes. Now hold it. Remember to keep your legs straight while you're stretching. And then slowly walk your fingers back up your legs. Let's do that one more time. Remember to keep your legs straight and hold it, hold it, hold it. Ah, now walk it back slowly. Whew. Now let's send it over to the Spears for some more stretches. Hey guys, I've got another leg stretch for us. We're gonna do a calf stretch. Keep your legs straight with your heel on the ground and your toes pointed up. All right, now let's switch to our other leg. Pull tight until you feel it in your calf muscle. Yeah, now let's do some ab stretches. Stand tall and stretch your arms onto the sky. Got it. Let's do some neck stretches. Stand tall and gently pull your neck to the left. Oh, yeah, let's go ahead and switch to the right side. Now let's move to the front. Stand up straight and look down while gently pushing your head forward. Whew. Let's go ahead and look straight up and gently push our head back. Yeah, buddy. Got the neck feeling nice and loose. Let's head back over to Miss Spears. Next up is our quadriceps. Balance on one foot and grab your other ankle. Pull it tightly to your booty while you're balancing in place. Gotta make sure we get both legs. Hmm, <laughs> I got another one for you. Stand tall and make an uppercase T with your body. For arm circles, your elbow should be straight and your hands should be stretched as far to the side as you can. And then you gently rotate your hands above and below your shoulders. And then we can increase our range of motion by practicing some backward shoulder rolls. All right, let's take a quick break. Now let's raise our arms back up and do some more shoulder rolls. Oh yeah, feel the burn. Now let's cool off and stretch our arms across our body. Start with your left arm and pull it tight. And then switch over to the right side. All right, now we've got some sumo squats. Keep your feet shoulder width apart and your head up. Keep your back straight and swing your arms while performing the squat. Yeah, we're almost done. Just two more quick leg stretches. 
For this hamstring stretch, lay flat on the ground and point your legs straight in the air. Now don't forget to do the other side. Oh yeah, now we're gonna finish out with a hurdle stretch. Copy the moves and get ready for our hiking workout. Meager Fitness Games is brought to you in part by Cardiovascular Systems Incorporated, keeping us alive one heartbeat at a time. The Cardiovascular System. It keeps us alive by pumping blood through our bodies. Blood delivers nutrients and oxygen to our cells. The Cardiovascular System is made up of heart, blood, and blood vessels. Heart is a muscle. Put your hand on your chest and move a little to the left. That's where your heart is. Now make a fist with your hand and that is about the size of your heart. Your heart has an important job of pumping blood to your body. It works with its pal, the lungs, to get oxygen to your body. Let's talk about heartbeats. Love versus death. Love. This is the first sound, which happens when some of the valves in the heart close. Duh. This is the second sound that happens when the valves squeeze the blood out of the heart and then close. Want to listen to your heart? It's easy. Start by lightly pressing on the skin anywhere there's a large artery running just beneath your skin, like the side of your neck and the inside of your wrist. You will feel a small beat under your skin called a pulse. Each time you feel your heart beat, it means your heart is pumping. 
Circulation Station. Circulation is how your blood moves through your heart and around the body. It takes less than 60 seconds to pump blood to every cell in your body. It also delivers oxygen to the cells in our body. We need it to stay alive. Go with the flow. Blood travels through your veins and arteries, which are a series of tubes that go all around your body. Arteries and veins are called blood vessels. Our blood vessels are attached to the heart. Arteries are the blood vessels that carry blood away from the heart. Veins are the ones that carry blood back to the heart. How to keep your heart healthy. Start by being active every day for at least 30 minutes. Eat five servings of fruit and veggies daily and limit the amount of sugary foods and drinks you consume. And no smoking. Cardiovascular Systems Incorporated, keeping us alive one heartbeat at a time. Learning Targets, Essential Knowledge and Skills Studios brings you I Can Statements. You can do it. Today, I Can create a safe, clean, and clear practice environment. I Can engage in activities that frequently increase my heart rate. I can mirror and copy the movements of an on-screen partner. I can demonstrate proper form and support my own body weight. And finally, I can use equipment safely in my own personal space. Learning targets. You can do it. Now it's time to practice some cardio for heart footwork and agility. If you're one of our friends at school, you just got to follow along with the skills in your line of cones. And if you're one of our friends at home and you don't have any cones, no worries. You can use some socks, some stuffed animals, or even pillows. Welcome back. Today in PE, we have agility cones. So grab whatever you've got, set up a safe space, and get ready. You may choose any of the following movement skills to practice your footwork and agility. Wait for the person in front of you to complete three cones, then begin. The first skill is jump tucks. Keep your feet together while hopping over the cones. After you finish, slow jog back to the end of your line.
shuffle or slide. You could also do walking lunges through the cones. Or squat jumps over the cones. high steps over the cones and sumo squat between the cones
finally, two of my favorites, Skate and Leap. We mainly use Flipgrid and Google Forms to check for understanding. More videos coming soon, but that's all for now. Coach Meager, signing out. Stay positive, stay safe, and stay active. <laughs>